he was great for being a good shoulder to listen and a great just mentor. Danielle Harding still can't believe her friend Curtis Young is dead. For the most part, it's just a numb feeling. Harnett County deputies responded to a call around 1230 this morning that Young was having a mental health episode and armed with a rifle walking down Highway 27. Deputies say they confronted him and tried to de-escalate the situation, but it didn't work. Harding talked to her friend just hours before his death and says the shooting took place less than a mile from Young's home. I could tell yesterday that he just, he wasn't feeling like his normal self. He was a little bit on the shakier side and he said, I just, I don't feel right, but I know that it'll pass. Harding says Young leaves behind four children. He helped me to seek mental health help personally and I would not trade any one of the experiences and conversations and laughs that I had with him for the world.